previously. I can't move. Everybody, this is Alchemist, and we are back, well rested and ready to go. I forgot which button to push. That's a good sign. All right. So when we left off, we were about to fight Vulcan Raven, and I got my ass kicked because I was tired and I kept walking into my own mines. Yeah, it's not exactly my shining moment, was it? But I'm well rested, and I've got caffeine, and I've got some sugar over here. A little recharge if I need it. Let's see if it makes the difference. I'm looking to get this game done tonight. It is one in the morning. I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. Let's see if we can make it happen. Do I want to... Let's move that if you saw my mouse. Sorry about that. Do I want to read the mission log? No. I'll probably read it when we're close to the end. But, uh... Not going to read it right now. Let me go ahead and call Otacon. Check the peaks just a second. What the hell are all these ravens doing around here? Ravens? They got me. There were ravens around from before, but for some reason they started to really increase in number around the same time that Foxhound came to the base. It's really weird. I, I wonder what it could mean. It means about to get my ass kicked. Okay, I'm going to take one second, because I am taking no chances. When I start going, it's going to be going till the end of the game. So, I want to make sure everything's working, because I really don't want to have to do this again. So, be back in a second. And I'm back. Alright, let's see. Turn on analog, even though it's been screwing me over. Nikita, C4. So, yeah, usually what I would do is I would, like, run around this guy and plant C4. So I guess I'll try that. Ye old myth bust, myth bust, myth bust, myth bust, ye old myth buster method. When in doubt, C4. Um, so let's see, what do we got? Let's take stock of where we are here. Got some rations, body armor... How am I going to want to attack this guy? I wonder, would the SOCOM be well advised? I don't have any Stinger. Uh, stingers would be great against him, but uh, I'm out, so... Let's see, PSG-1 is kind of a bad idea. He's very mobile. PSG-1 would leave me basically with no way to run. Uh, really, Claymores and C4. Laying traps for this guy is how I beat him a long time ago. And it's pretty much the way to go. But uh, I'm going to have some fun with this. I'm going to try out some different methods, see how they work. So, might die, might not, but... Uh, let's go ahead and shoot him once, though, for the stress he's caused. Oh, that's right. The card interacts with the salt in my body. Fucking open the door.
Hmm. What's that? Welcome, Cossack. This is the end of the road for you, right, my friends? They're becoming excited. Ravens aren't scavengers like most people think. They're simply returning to the natural world that which is no longer needed. Sometimes, they even attack wounded foxes. You were the one in the M1 tank? Must have been a tight fit for a big boy like you. <laughs> <laughs> but that was no true battle. <laughs> Ravens and I were testing to see what kind of man you were. The judgment is decided! The Ravens say you are a true warrior. Am I hallucinating? I... I can't move! Raven has put the mark of death upon you. Blood from the east flows within your veins. Ah, your ancestors too were raised on the barren plains of Mongolia. Inuit and Japanese are cousins to each other. We share many ancestors, you and I. There's no crows in my family tree. You ready? I am not fond of snakes, but you are family, so I cannot complain. But there will be no holding back. <laughs> you live in Alaska, too. You know of the World Eskimo Indian Olympics. With that strength, you must have been training in the stick pull and four-man carry. Yes, you are right. But there is another event that I excel at. It is called the Ear Pull. It's an event where two opponents pull each other's ears while enduring the harsh cold. It tests spiritual as well as physical strength. You want to pull each other's ears? The form is different, but the spirit is the same. Rejoice, Snake! Ours will be a glorious battle. This isn't glorious. It's just plain killing. Violence isn't a sport. Well, we will see if there is iron in your words.
Uh, for those of you who haven't played MGS2, you'll see. We've already seen this. Already seen that, too. Whoa! What you wish for, bitch. Whoop. Ooh, that pissed him off. Good God, that pissed him off a lot. Yeah, I can't really hit him with, uh, Sawcom. That sucks, because Sawcom's been good to me. Oh! Oh, he coming. Unlucky. Really, I think this guy is annoying no matter what. Okay, is he going to walk that way? No, he's not. Got to use... Ooh, got him. Oh, he's coming this way, isn't he? Oh, yeah, he's coming. Coming that way. Which way are you going? coming this way. Alright, let's get that C4 ready, see if we can fucking geek this motherfucker. Yes, I've been playing lots of Shadowrun. Fuck off! Okay, is he coming that way? Let's see. Let's find out. Alright, no, he's not, but we can launch an Akita at his ass. I might have made him a little angry. Okay. Oh, shit. I did make him angry. Where's he coming? Where's he going? Oh, where is he? Where is he in relation to me? He has been angered. Oh, he's spraying like a motherfucker. Oh, he pissed. Oh, shit. Come on. Oh, he's angry. Crikey, I pissed this one right off. Come on now. 
gonna get ready for that C4 because he's about to come my way. Ooh, he's angry. Ooh, he's pissed. Let's go ahead and uh, put this ration on. Ooh, he's coming there. Oh shit. <laughs> like a ghost. Oh. Follow me, bitch. <laughs> All right, come on. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Come on. There you go. Are you coming this way? No, you're not. Okay. Mm, should I... Uh, I don't know if I should chug another one of those. Come here. Come here. Got something for you. Got you a present. Got you another one if you go that way. Oh, you didn't. <laughs> uh, where are you coming from? Where are you coming from? Come from there. Come on. Where you are? Where are you? Ooh, that hurt. Oh. Is he coming my way? No, he's not. Put one there, too. Put one there. Go ahead and use another one before he gets frozen. Oh, I almost got him. Oh, are you coming here? Are you coming this way? I've got a present for you. You're going to like it. Whoa! Gotcha! Just as the boss said, it is my existence which is no longer needed in this world. But... My body will not remain in this place. My spirit and my flesh will become one with the ravens. You'll become their poop. That way, I will return to Mother Earth who bore me. As their perp. As their perp? As their poop. Their poop. poop. Yeah, whatever. I will be watching you. Understand? As poop. Snake. Take this security card. It will open the door. Why? You are a snake which was not created by nature. You and the boss. You are from another world. A world that I do not wish to know. Go and do battle with him. I will be watching from above. First, I'll give you a hint. The man who you saw die before your eyes. Remember this guy. What is it? That was not the Dharma Chief. It was Decoy Octopus. A member of Foxhound. That's not a hint. That's just telling me shit. I demand a hint. Master of disguise. He copied his subjects down to the blood. So he drained the chief's blood and took it into himself. But he wasn't able to deceive the Angel of Death. The Angel of Death? But why 
Why go to so much trouble? Why impersonate the chief? <laughs> that is the end of my hint. You must solve the rest of the riddle yourself. Snake, in the natural world, there's no such thing as boundless slaughter. There's always an end to it. But you are different. What are you trying to say? The path you walk on has no end. Each step you take is paved with the corpses of your enemies. Their souls will haunt you forever. You shall have no peace. Hear me, Snake. My spirit will be watching. And then he was bird shit. Snake, it's me. Liquid Master. It's about Naomi. Turn your monitor off. What about Naomi? Damn. Colonel, is Naomi there? No, she's away. She's taking a short nap. Hmm. So what is this about Naomi? Okay, maybe we better let the Colonel hear this too. Yeah, go on, Master. Well, basically, Dr. Naomi Hunter is not Dr. Naomi Hunter at all. What? I thought her story of her background sounded kind of fishy, so I checked it out. And? There is an actual Dr. Naomi Hunter, or I should say, there was one. But she's not the woman we know. The real Naomi Hunter disappeared somewhere in the Middle East. Our Naomi must have somehow obtained her identification papers. So then, who is she really? She must be some kind of... spy. A spy? Yes. Maybe she's been sent to sabotage this operation. Are you saying she's with the terrorists? I don't want to believe it either, but she is working for Foxhound. So you think she had a part in the uprising? Or she could be working with some different group altogether. Different group? It couldn't be. Place her under arrest. What? She's betrayed us. She needs to be arrested and interrogated to find out who she's with. If she's one of their spies, then we're in big trouble. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. Have you let her in on some kind of vital secret or something? Does this have anything to do with the mysterious deaths of the DARPA chief and the arms tech president? I... I have no idea. Anyway, we cannot allow her to participate any further in this mission. Wait, wait a minute. Without her, we can't complete this mission. I knew it. You're hiding something. Give me some time. I'll try to get it out of her. Hurry, then. We've got to figure out who she is and what she's doing here. I understand. Snake, give me some time. I don't have any time left for you. God, Roy. I trusted you, Roy. So, I'm unsure if... Stinger missiles, Joy. Um, I don't know if this room is, like, stuck in the state it was in, like, at the end of the fight, or if it just automatically changes, uh, depending, like, when you finish to, like, amount of damage to it. I wasn't sure if it changes back as well. Uh, we will be coming back to this room. It will be a pain in the ass. Um, but for now, I think we're good. I think we're good. Uh, it's a good thing it gave us the Stinger missiles because we're going to need them before we get... Also, we have a level 7 card, so if we wanted to go back to the snowfield for that one room, we could. I don't think I will be, though. But this is why the Stinger Missile... Yeah. Blah, blah. This is why the Stinger Missile is coming handy, because for this fucking room. For some reason, all these gun cameras give not a shit if you are, uh... 
firing missiles in the room. Can't imagine why. Shoddy workmanship. Okay. Okay. At least one person is really pissed off at me doing this. It's no good. I can't do it. Okay. Okay. I know I can hit that. I know I can hit that. <sighs> Fuck, that's a tight shot. Okay, what do we got here? Ooh, st more stingers! Okay, well... Fuck off. I'll take it. And more stingers. More stingers is what you get. This room is all about the damn stinger ammo. Stinger. 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 Okay. This is probably my favorite room in the game. Remember the first time I played this game, I was like, holy shit, there it is. Metal Gear. I think this room is so fucking cool. Just like the camera, just like that camera angle right there. Like, it's... Camera there. Just like that camera angle being right there, you know? Actually, that's a cracker, but, uh, whatever. At least I think it is. So, um, wacky hijinks will ensue in this room. We still have a little bit, a little ways to go before we're ready for the big showdown. Okay, 
keep trying. And the bromance begins. Philanthropy, the early days. Philanthropy. Okay, let's take a nice look around. Some stuff over there. I don't see any guards patrolling on this side, so that's good. A lot of noisy catwalks here. This is where the game starts getting a little dicey. Very few places to hide. Stinger missile, there we go. The game is also loading us down with stinger missiles for a reason. I, I love that this entire room is just built around this thing that you know is going to come to life and you're going to have to fight it. Uh, I th just think this room is so fucking cool. I also think Metal Gear Rex looks really cool. I really like the um, the aesthetics of this thing. Um, it was designed for the it was designed with the PlayStation hardware in. Oh, here we go. Snake, I did it. You got past security. Bingo. So what do you got? I accessed the confidential Metal Gear file. So what about the pal Baker talked about? I haven't found it yet. That's what I need to know. But Snake. I found something else. What? The secret behind the new nuclear weapon. Just as I thought, the nuclear warhead is designed to be fired from the railgun like a projectile. It, it doesn't use fuel, so it isn't considered a missile. That way it can get around all sorts of international treaties. Pretty sneaky. Yes, but effective. And that's not even the scariest thing about this weapon. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. It's a stealth weapon. You mean it won't show up on radar? Yeah. The truth is, they've been working on a stealth missile since the late 70s. Why weren't they able to develop one until now? Because of the missile rocket propulsion system. It would be picked up by enemy satellites. Oh yeah, that makes sense. But unlike a missile, the railgun doesn't burn any propellant, so it can't be detected by any current ballistic missile detection systems. An invisible nuclear warhead. Totally impossible to intercept. And on top of that, it's got a surface-piercing warhead designed to penetrate hardened underground bases. Yeah, we learned that lesson in the Gulf War. This thing could mean the end of the world! It's the ultimate weapon. And from a political point of view, it avoids the problem of nuclear reduction and nuclear inspections. Colonel, is this true? Are you listening? I'm listening. If word of this got out, it could delay the signing of the START III treaty and cause a huge international incident. Yeah, it would be nasty. The United States would be denounced by the UN. It could even bring the president down. Did you know this, Colonel? I'm sorry. You've changed, Colonel. I won't make any excuses. Snake, listen to me. This new nuclear weapon, it's never actually been tested, only simulated. You mean they ran a computer model? Yeah, that's why they were conducting exercise. They needed to get actual experimental data to back up the simulation. What were the results of the exercise? It looks like it went better than they hoped for, but I can't find the data anywhere on this network. You'd think the data as important as that would be carefully recorded. It was. President Baker gave me an optical disk with all of the test data. What? Do you still have it? No. Ocelot took it from me. Damn. The terrorists have replaced the dummy warhead with a real warhead. Once they input the detonation codes, they should be ready to launch. So you think they can do it? Well, the dummy warhead was designed to be identical to the real thing, so I think so. Did you find out how to override it yet? Not yet. It must be in a separate file. Right now I'm looking through all of Baker's personal files. We're counting on you. Sorry I'm not talking that much during there, but uh, I really um, I really love the storyline of Metal Gear Solid 1, and uh, and I really just wanted to, like, let the characters talk. Um, but yeah, I really like the design of Rex. Rex was designed with the PlayStation 1 hardware in mind, so he's very... So he's big, but he's low poly, and I don't know, something about Rex's design, I've always thought it was just awesome. Way cooler than Ray. Ray was a little too funky. Okay. Okay, let's 
let's chill here for a moment. Okay, I can see a guard there. I wonder if I can nail him from here. Let's see. Where's my pills? I know I've got one. Yeah, there we are. Okay, got items there. Okay, got him here. There we go. I think that's the only guy in here. That's usually the only guard you really have to worry about, so I think we're in the clear. snack ready because uh, it's going to take a while. Okay. There's a camera right in there, so I'm going to crawl over here. Snatch that. Could always use ammo. Trusty old Sawcom. Yeah. Okay. Up the stairs. Okay. 